I live in Trinity's Place. Anybody can be able to come there that's LGBTQ. I do not have my own room. I share a big, huge space. We have to wake up at 6.30, but we do have to leave by 8 o'clock in the morning. Every morning, um, I care for my grandmother. She has dementia. We have coffee and breakfast together. I live in Newark, New Jersey. I'm still there. I'm still living in the same house that I grew up in. I'm usually up and out of the bed by 5.30. My name is Tanya Daniels. I'm the program manager for Helen Keller International's Child Sight Program here in New York. We target children or students that live below the poverty level. We are on target to screen a little over 30,000 students this year. HKI started providing services to the homeless youth a little over three years ago. We started the services at the Covenant House and moved on to Ali Forney Center, as well as Women in Need. 75% of the youth we see in the homeless shelters end up needing eyeglasses. Some of them haven't had glasses ever, and then there's some that haven't had glasses in years. My name is Cheyenne Barcio. I grew up in Queens. I was living with my mom, and I would go and see my dad from time to time. I got abused by my mother's boyfriend, and I went to foster care. They moved me far away from my family so that this way, my mom wouldn't try and follow. I heard about Helen Keller from Ali Forney Center. It felt like I could be able to breathe again. When Cheyenne received her glasses today, she actually jumped up and down. Straight out. Perfect. Yeah, I can see. <laughs> I'm so happy. And it made me feel good. I had a warm feeling inside to know that I was a part of her happiness. I think it's a stereotype that everybody just assumes homeless means on the street, literally. But homeless could mean a whole slew of things. They have extraordinary talents, well-spoken, but just have been through difficult issues or situations in their lives. Doesn't mean they can't go on and be successful. This is where Child Sight comes in to help with that. Just a simple pair of glasses, it can change someone's world. I have had this dream from when I was seven that I've always wanted to cook and own my own business. It is my hope that Child Sight could expand. I cannot imagine myself anywhere else other than HKI. It says a lot for the agency and my relationship with the people that I work with and what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. I like to take my long walk from 107th Street to 42nd Street and Times Square. I see a lot of friends here. It feels tremendously good to be able to see again. I feel like that it can be able to help me with anything and everything. I would like to have my own house one day. But I'm trying to do baby steps. I think that I will get there. I have, I have, you know, the mindset that I will get there.